it's a jazzy way to celebrate a grand opening, a bread-breaking ceremony. We want you to gather around the table with us. A table that looked more like hungry kids. Here we go. It's official. Waiting for Thanksgiving dinner. And we pride ourselves on the quality of our ingredients and the freshness of our ingredients. We're really committed to the local communities. Lauren Romanski says the Miami Valley was ripe for the picking, their seventh location in Ohio. An added touch, Dayton products are the company's bread and butter, showing what foods are from around here. The city is even showcased in the vegetables. And with Whole Foods coming to Dayton, they're hoping to plant a seed and watch it grow in the community. We didn't have to look far before seeing generosity in action. Members of the food bank, like Laura Davenport, are grateful for a new partnership. Right away, you know, our very first day, we're actually pick, going to be picking up food from the bakery. And she tells us the need is always present, with more than 130,000 people in the Miami Valley being food insecure. The partnership will give healthy alternatives to those who wouldn't normally have the option. It's just so good for our clients who need healthy food on their tables. Whole Foods is pitching in to other not-for-profit organizations like Homeful and On the Rise, as they'll receive a nickel every time one of those recyclable bags are used. Jake Ryle, 5 on 2.